what's going on collectors optical 20 here for another video review this time it's the michael jordan black version from enter bay and you can purchase this figure at bigbadtoystore.com just click the link in the description and as usual we're going to start off with a box uh, this is a nice looking box uh compared to uh, the first at least the away version that i have uh this is more elegant looking more professional um the first one it's 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 nice in a sense, but at the same time, it looks like it's all over the place. It has the uh, uh, the Michael Jordan picture in the front. I guess this is the turning point for Enter Bay where this looks more classy, you know, so to speak. Minimalistic design. Uh, you saw that on my Scottie Pippen, Kobe Bryant. Now they use the uh, jersey of the actual figure. Uh, so here's to the last shot. This is actually not the last shot. <laughs> it's funny because it's, it's not. It's um, the... Um, yeah, what do you call this there's a last shot as well he was wearing the red version but this is uh um i didn't even notice this is the uh, the last shot has a different um box it's like a red one um but yeah this is the i would say this is the um special edition the black one it says nba on the side and right here on the other side you can see him wearing the the jersey his black jersey kind of like a nice picture of him there you go like a really subtle uh, dot matrix effect pretty nice you know i, I kind of like this this minimalistic design for michael jordan and um you see right here so there's so many uh versions of michael jordan now it's ridiculous because you, you can buy the jerseys on ebay so uh one of the most ridiculous one that i've seen is the, um, the all-star version i mean the, the head doesn't even look like him screaming and and if you really want that kind of version just just buy a jersey you know and then change it up it's not like it's hard to do but here you go so I, I'll if um, if you ask me which Jordan version to buy I would say either this or the last sh last shot version the one that just came out with a t-shirt and all that stuff the red away is pretty good as well but uh, it comes with a nice sort of accessories but compared to this you know it doesn't have the trophy but as you can see there, he does come with the uh, warmer, which is I'm, I'm pretty scared to put on him for a long time because, you know, I'm scared of staining and all that stuff. But as far as, you know, because everyone has a trophy, you know, you get a Kobe, you get a trophy, you get a Scottie Pippen, you get a trophy. So it's nothing special. However, um, you know, with him, he comes with like a good vast array of hands that kind of sets him apart as you can see those gripping hands this one is a bit different these are you know normally you get this the the magnetized hand but he has a you know like this bigger grip of a hand i would say that's for palming the ball or dunking or and he also has this i love this hand it's the follow-through hand um you know it kind of like gives you that you know when he after he takes a jump shot kind of like this follow through you kind of put the peg down which something that the previous version doesn't the pointy hands it's not nothing too special i call that the uh you know like the defense hands you know like he when you spread your hands upon the, the, the defeat uh defensive stance um and other version has that as well the um to me it's the head sculpt and this guy right here however you, you can buy this on ebay as well you know that's the beauty of enter bay because if let's say if you want to buy a wizard's jersey of michael jordan all you need is a base so basically it's head sculpt uh uniform you can buy uh shoes you can buy but head sculpt you can also buy for uh like bootleg ones but the head sculpt is a is a hit or miss because you don't know what you're getting uh this is a nice quality right here uh, it has buttons on the side um so if it kind of likes like a real it works like a real warmer so you know, if you, it's not a problem putting it on and off for him. You know, you don't even need to take his shoes off. And also the jacket is nice quality. Um, I'm just scared because, you know, the inner fabric is red. So, you know, this kind of figures. If you watch my LeBron review, his his socks and, and all that stuff is staining on his body. So, you know at least that gets covered so unlike on this guy it's the entire body his arms and everything so you know as you can see there there's the buttons that connects it there so 
you know if you take it out and it starts staining then you're kind of screwed because it's the entire body that you, you can't cover it up you know unlike with michael Ju uh lebron james which you know he got his warmer his leg warmers and all that stuff and uh as he also has this inner shorts pretty nice um and also the shoes that he comes with uh he comes with i believe two pairs uh you got the jordan ones and jordan 13s which is the playoffs i like this i have this version you know they came out i think the, they just came out with a black cat but these are the uh the og ones and also the uh the band version the the jordan ones uh he also comes with i must say though putting the shoes are a pain it's a hit or miss as, as well sometimes i can get it in really quickly another thing that i hate about this jordan 13s are the uh uh the laces they keep on coming off um you know you can super glue them but i almost doesn't want to play with my uh with my figures like that you know i try not to i try to keep them as uh as stock as po possible it also comes with a magnetized ball as usual for any enter bay um, nba figures and the uh, michael jordan stand right here and these are the og ones um that i'm talking about i missed the release of this guy too man I, just kicking myself it was last year for 150 or 159 i think you know i always wanted to have one i have the other variations of the og ones the breads but um you know miss the og this this original one i also i only have the uh, like the mid ones oh, right there nike air obviously they have the license for this i'm pretty sure answer they paid a big price uh to get michael jordan's likeness and that's why they're milking it that's why they're releasing a version after version uh, i wish they they, they kind of given the kobe treatment where we get the uh, younger michael jordan you can see there bulls 23 so this is the black jersey version you also have the white uh, home version the away the i'm back 45 um the all-star version I'm, I'm not even sure what kind of version we can get maybe the slam dunk version where he has a uh, golden chain you know that that is uh that would be interesting as well as you can see there i haven't inserted the shorts yet but i will you know um you know his shoes right there so you know it's it's an enter bay body and it's an nba figure so that's you know nothing really fancy they all look the same they got socks shoes uh it all depends on your knowledge into basketball or your you know how you like shoes a lot obviously that that knee is gonna look ugly but there's some certain figures that say like lebron james or kevin durant or uh, Derek Rose who has knee pads who kind of hides that in Jordan's case um, he has a um, you know you can pull that knee pads up so kind of covers up his knees although that's not going to be really accurate but his at least his uh, elbows are pretty much covered um, but like guys like Allen Iverson you know who has the uh, sleeves that would look good because that kind of hides the joints uh, if they ever come up with a Carmelo Anthony 1-6, because I know they, they came up with the one ninth, that would look good as well. I hope they do, you know, because I already started my 1-6. I don't want to go to one ninth uh, now. And then one ninth just has too many joints for my liking. And as far as the head sculpt, I really love this head sculpt as well. As you can see, the, the, the white on his eye is not really all that white, like, you know, Michael Jordan. But um, I would say the difference between this and the... Um, the red version is you know obviously the head sculpt you know the shoes are different but i love this head, head sculpt particularly because if you're trying to you know take a picture of this figure with another one which is i have rodman and kobe and scotty pippen is that you can do some action you know poses unlike the other head sculpt which he looks kind of bored that's more of a static he's shooting free throw kind of kind of look this look is more of a you know i'm gonna dunk on you i'm gonna take a jump shot you know mouth open uh it's not too intense unlike the uh the all-star version where he looks like you know he's he's mad but he's just dribbling the ball you know i, I don't get it myself but this is more of a you know action pose so to speak that's why i like this in the kobe v2 um mouth is only slightly open but it makes a ton of difference as far as um the look uh that you can create you know gives you that um like i said he you can make him do a dunking pose or a jump shot or um a defensive pose because on the other red version i mean you can you can achieve the same way but it just looks a bit weird and um you know i'm gonna throw in some poses with him because 
this is the beauty of Enter Bay, and if you, especially if you like basketball, and I'm pretty sure you won't buy this if you don't. Um, you can see that the jump shot that I'm talking about. He has that um, follow through sets of hands. Pretty awesome. You know, you can, you can rec recreate his last shot. However, he, he didn't wear the, the black jersey. But like I said, you know, if, if you wanted the red jersey, I have one on the other side. But if you, you don't need multiple figures of the same character. I mean, if it's Michael Jordan, I don't blame you. If you want to put Michael in a white uniform, black, so be it, man. I love Michael Jordan. Uh, that's why I got two, you know. And uh, But if you're a little tight on budget, uh, you can even buy the USA jersey online for like twenty, thirty dollars. So you know variations, like I said. But with Michael, I guess you can get away with it. You know, having Michael Jordan with multiple—it's like having Iron Man or Batman. You know, you can't have a, you can't have too much of those. You know, uh, I, I don't, I don't suggest you do that with other figures. Like you know, you got like two Dennis Rodmans. Also, there's only one Dennis Rodman that they released, but. You know what I mean, but yeah, with Michael Jordan, this is one post that I, I kind of, this is kind of my go-to post for this figure. You know, him dunking using the, uh, the I would say the the better gripping hand for basketball, and uh, here is just dribbling the ball, you know, looking looking nice and fancy right there. I haven't even installed the shorts yet, but yeah, you know, one of these days uh, when I find the time, I'm gonna, I have him, Kobe Bryant. I'm waiting for a LeBron Cavs one. You know, if they come up with a LeBron two pack between the Heat and the Lakers, you know, that's something I'd be interested in. Kind of like with what they did with Shaq, because you know, as much as you know, I'm I'm not big fan of the guy. You know, I'm just not a big fan of his antics and and the way he gets to the top. I mean, he's one of the better players. He's one of the best players in the league. I think he's gonna come down as. The second best ever, um, you know, st statistics wise, uh, he can break every record there is. He's only 31, 32, and he got like long ways to go. Uh, he's still on the top of his game, but one thing that uh, I would say he would never duplicate was is that, you know, how Jordan handled it. You know, it's not about the ship, you know, it's not just about the ship or the statistics and all that stuff. It's how you get it, you know, and, and Michael did it in, in a more. I would say relatable way where we want we as fans wanted to see it you know it's he worked his way to the top he he overcame Detroit and a lot of people would say yeah he did the same thing but it's there's a difference you know he Michael made the other people around him who they were and like him the kind of you know you want you want to see a person rise to the occasion not is not the one that's equipped for the occasion you know he, he got two all -star. he has two all-stars every single time that he won a championship you know I'm not saying that Michael did the same thing because he got Scotty Pippen but he, that's one and you can make the argument that he made Scotty Pippen who he is Dwayne Wade is already good you know uh, Bosch was already good he was an all-star and Olympian bef you know when they joined together so the same thing can be said about Kyrie yeah, an all-star MVP, you know, he's a rookie of the year. Kevin Love, you know, an accomplished guy. So, uh, but yeah, about this video, for, that's for another topic right there. You got sidetracked a little bit, but you know, you create this jump shot pose. Really nice looking pose right here. So there's a variation of poses that you can do, which is pretty awesome, you know. And then, um, like I said, you can, this is the, uh, as you can see the face right there, it's, it's uh, relaxed. I didn't change the hands, but... You know, it's more suitable for the red version when he's wearing this um, this warmer because I mean, it kind of looks weird if he's intense. Maybe if he's dunking or anything, but if you're just standing, you know, the I would say the red away version is a lot better equipped for this uh, warmer right here. Which I know this is the uh, special edition, as you can see. I was just pointing out the uh, the buttons on the side, so you don't really need to take off pants or anything you know just to include them on or the shorts you can see it from the side it's uh, kind of sticking out so beautiful figure it comes with you know decent enough accessories um had i wish it came with the um i believe this is more expensive originally I, however i didn't buy it for that much but um i know i wish it would have came with um mvp trophy you know i know it came with my red version and i know in the white it came with the trophy but since technically this is considered a special edition not the regular edition like the black and white um the red and white one 
so I wish it would have came with a little bit more extra, like to make it a few, to make it a little bit more special, you know, like a T-shirt or something like that. Um, so that's it. As you can see there, that's my two Jordans. Uh, would would I add more? If I if I will ever do, it's probably gonna be the last shot. However, I don't see myself picking that one up. Uh, I already got the Action Jordan. I got the Stagnant Jordan. So I think that's that's enough Jordan for me. And unless, unless they come up with a younger Jordan, I I'm probably gonna pick that up as well. Big fan, you know, big fan here, especially from Chicago. Growing up, this is my guy right here. Uh, you know every 90s kids hero the one who watches basketball greatest of all time the goat um so yeah if you are gonna pick up a jordan figure from enter bay i suggest the last shot or this guy right here i'm leaning towards the last shot because of the the red jersey is more iconic you know than the black jersey but the reason i picked this up is because i already got the red away jersey so and then the shoes as well you know you can't go wrong with either shoes you know the other guy has uh you know some shirt and hat you know this guy has a warmer so can't really go wrong if i were you i'd pick up both but gotta choose i would say last shot and then this and then maybe the red and white version so thank you for watching guys and uh i'll see you in 